Yep, that's cracking people. So, just had to drop a call at my dad's workshop, which is that thing. This, I don't know why he's working on that, but anyway. Honey over here bought the Civic. So I'm gonna take you for a walk through the workshop. See if you like it. Check it out. So here we're inside the workshop. I actually come up this way because I can stand up top and show you quickly what's over here before I take you for a close walk and show you the shit that's actually here. Wait for wait for it. So it's sorted up here too. Stuck the spare parts section up top here. But this is where we want to be looking. So we want to be looking. <laughs> What's up, Lan? Hello. So this is whatever they've got here today. And then check it the beast. Look oh, that sad looks. No! <laughs> Yeah, this is the workshop here, what's in here at the moment. 9.30 turbo. Lotus up top in the middle there. God damn. All these 911s. Huh? Let's go take a close look, eh? These are weird ass noise. Huh? For a close look. Show you what's the good shit. In the workshop. Okay. First, the best thing here. The best thing. Oh. Ooh. Okay. See, there's nothing that's going on with this thing. Inside information on this 968. So the block came from the US in this thing, and my dad slapped one of these bad boys on it. A fat ass charger. He first installed a, um, a smaller supercharger on here, and then the guy wanted more power eventually. So it came back and he put that thing, that bigger charger, on there this week. And just came back from the diner. He told me just before, I'll see if I can find the diner papers. Don't think it's in the car, but guess the power. Actually, guess the power of this thing. I'll say the power in the video soon, but guess the power. 3 liter, 968, supercharged. What's your guess, boy? What's your guess? All in all, though, what a nice car. It's a bit high at the front, though. <laughs> not too bad, yeah, not too bad. So, yeah. He's a man of the hour. Look what he's working on today. I've never even seen one of these before. What? What is this? This is a Lotus Esprit Turbo. And you are doing today? Full you? major service, cam belt. Mm. Nice. Came in this morning and Dad had the whole workshop to himself because it is Sunday. No other crazy motherfucker is going to be working on Sunday besides him. In saying that, check check this thing out on the hoist. Oh, check this, check this little beast. Not bad. Bit of a weird thing. Don't actually know what that is. But one of my favourite cars here at the moment has to be Snags. Check it, this beast. This Porsche right here, this 964. Is the first Porsche I've been in that had AO 50s on it. And nigger, let me tell you, 
those tires. They stick like shit. They stick like glue. Okay, that that tire right there made me realize that tires actually do work. Have a look at this car, bro. So clean for that car. And this here is Russ Kempridge. He's going to bat us with this thing. To race this. This is also another crazy guy. Lots of Porsches. And yeah, I'm going to tell you more about this snag. And this thing is beautiful. I'm going to take you for a quick walk inside. I'll walk inside. I'm going to show you the inside of this. Okay. Full track car. It's got hydraulic suspension in it. And then, first of all, this seat's real comfy. Nice cage too. Oh, shit. It's so clean. Well done for the track portion yeah. that. So I'm gonna show you the inside of this lotus quickly. Not bad. Let's take a look. Check these door handles. It's like 19 when was this called mate? <clears throat> 1972. Not bad. Comfort in my bed. Look at the dash. <laughs> Jesus. That's so weird. Oh my gosh. It's almost like a Del Sol. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> Tell me how many of you know of this or have seen one of these before in Brisbane? Anyone? What's in the works in this one? Yeah, that's on the hoist. Oil licks and a new clutch for this bad boy. Can't forget the BBSs. So, I was just told that this car before that I said I have no idea what it is. 924, and they fitted some big cams in there. And they put some new sideys on this bitch. People spend some money on their race cars, eh? Fuck. Yeah, we think we spend lots of money. And we don't even spend pennies compared to these people. Have a look at this. God damn. Right, there's, so, there's so much to show you in this workshop. Okay, I'll take you for a walk through this way. I won't bump my head. I'll take you for a walk through this way. Mm, mm, mm. First, I'm gonna give you another quick look at my vehicle. Oh man, I'm looking at it. Oh man. Oh man. You're gonna just sit in there. So, this is where I worked for two and a half years with my dad. But anyway, I wanna show you this. This is engine room. It's hella empty at the moment. Damn. Check this thing, this is like this little engine room. Pretty good, pretty good. I'll come back here, you can see maybe. So it's air condensed shit in here. This is where the man just chills all day. Sometimes when he has to build engines, he'll be in here, obviously. Yeah, yeah so that one's got its own door onto it. Close that shit, come in here. And they've got like their, their bench top where you can make your shit. Got a clean room, quick tour. 
in there. And I showed you the upstairs, the offices, and all the stuff is done that way. I won't have to show you that now, but uh, yeah. So, check this in. This they built as they like. As they work Lemon's car, okay? Now, let me tell you something. This fucking Corolla is a beast. It's done, what, four Lemons now, which is 24 hour races. And man, what a ball of fun to drive. This thing handles better than, better than your MR2, Caleb. Better than, better than your DC2. It's locked. That's pretty embarrassing. But, yeah, let me check, check the cage up in this bitch. And, full track car. <laughs> so every piece of aftermarket suspension you can think about it. Big old fat juicy tires that you really don't want. But hey, it's the workshop banger. <laughs> it's the workshop gang bang car that. And I just saw Dad pop the hood on this thing. Bang! Not like an eight cylinder. <whistles> Alright, so you know when you do a workshop visit. One of the things you have to do is a motherfucking coffee run. So that's where we're going. Get a full coffee run. Line, guess where we're going? Get coffee. So today, that's going to wrap up my, my workshop visit. I'll take you somewhere else. Stay tuned. Boom. What's up, homies? Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. <laughs> so that's a wrap for us. Just got home now. Yo, Civic. So now... We're gonna have to work on this beast. Got a couple little things we gotta do on this one. I might show you what I do to that, maybe. But yeah, hope you enjoyed the video and give it a like, give it a share, tell your friends about it. Some weird people here with me. <laughs>